Welcome to all of you. In this video, we are going to learn how to draw the pentagonal plane by angle method. For uh, learning the procedure or understanding the procedure, we will take a condition. We have to draw a regular pentagonal plane of side 50 mm. So all of you know, the pentagonal structure is nothing but having five sides. And if it is a regular pentagon, means each and every side is having the same dimension. That is 50 mm, 50 mm, 50 mm. So this is the nature of the pentagonal plane. So as per the name of the method, angle method we are going to learn here. So we have to use a formula to find out the angle of a particular pentagonal plane. That is angle is equal to 360 divided by number of sides. That is applicable for our other polygons also. So presently we are drawing or presently we are uh, drawing a pentagonal plane. So number of sides are 5. So the next step is 360 divided by 5 total number of sides. The answer will be 72 degree. So that 72 degree angle will be from the outside of the pentagonal plane from one of the corner point. In this case, we are going to consider this is the first side that we are going to draw. So from the corner point of this horizontal edge or side, the outer angle is 72 degree. So the inner angle of the pentagon at the particular one corner, uh, one of the corner point with that same edge is 108 degree. So either we can make the use of 72 degree angle from the outside or 108 degree from the inner side. This is the base of this procedure. So let's see one by one, uh, step by step, how to draw the pentagonal plane. So initially we have to draw a horizontal line. As per the requirement, we can draw the vertical line also, but we are learning the basic procedure. So draw the first horizontal line of given side, that is a 50 mm. So the length of the line is nothing but 50 mm. Name that line as a A and B point, that is the end points of the first line of the pentagon and having the name A, B, C, D, E. So as per the procedure, as per the angle, either 72 degree from the outer side or 108 from inner side. So I will make the use of the angle of inner angle that is 108. So from one of the corner point, initially from corner point B or end point B, I will draw the represent the angle 108 with the angle measuring device and I will draw a line. And as per the uh, nature of the polygonal uh, plane that is a regular pentagonal plane each and every side will be having the 50 mm length so i will mark the 50 mm length with the help of scale and i will name that end point of the line c as a uh, one of the next point of the pentagonal plane similarly we have to follow the same procedure at a first point also from point a with the help of angle measuring device we have to uh, mark the angle 108 degree and from this we have to draw one more line and that line should have the length 50 mm and name that point as the last point E point. So these are the three edges or sides of the pentagonal plane. The remaining two edges we have to represent with the help of compass. So by making the use of the compass, we have to measure the length of A to B in the compass and consider the point C and E are the uh, starting point to draw the arc. So by keeping the one of the end of the compass uh, on the C point, we have to draw the arc like this. Then similarly from E point we have to draw the second arc these two arcs should be get intersect and that will be our uh, one of the uh, remaining point of the pentagonal plane that will be D so with the help of scale we have to join the point C to D that is the fourth side of the pentagonal plane and E to D that will be the last fifth side of the pentagonal plane so this is the basic procedure to draw the pentagonal plane by using angle method either we can make the use of 108 or 72 degree so thank you very much